Oh hello, it's Steven. I hope you are all doing well. And in this video, I will give a review of Jollibee food and also give a tour of my apartment in Singapore. Let's go. So there are three rooms here and my one is room C. This is the living room in here like you can find there is a washing machine and also a dryer and over here there is a kitchen and sink and microwave. So guys once we enter the room here uh, this is the sink this is where usually I brush my teeth and also drink water and that's the stove over here you can cook and you can do a lot of things here prepping your food Got some bananas over there coffees tolak angin and on the top there you can have a microwave to heat up your food and also here is a cupboard you can store your stuff and we got a table here this is usually where I work for my content and if you look close here you can find the PowerPoint and if you click this one uh, that's for the lights down here it's pretty cool right oh the bed is so comfortable so yeah guys, every time I go overseas, check into the hotel, first thing first, I like to check their television shows. You know like, it is very interesting uh, to watch international shows or international movies. Anyway, let's move to the next one. So yeah guys, this is the wardrobe here. And down here is the fridge. Ooh, it's actually nothing here. So that's our bathroom here. It actually looks pretty good and clean. It's just quite small. So that's the end of the tour apartment, guys. There are three things I like about these apartments. Firstly, it's because the price we paid only 2800 a month it's quite cheap compared to another hotel or airbnb so if you want to save money and use your money for travels or for food this is the right place secondly it's the location guys because the location is very close and convenient it's close to other restaurants uh, to shopping centers like Takashimaya, Paragon, and also Lucky Plaza, and it is also close uh, to Mount Elizabeth Hospital and Paragon Medical. So, thirdly, uh, because the apartment is clean and it's quite new, even though it is small, but I think it does the job, you know, like you can sleep here you can eat and then you can wash your uh, clothes here so yeah i think i'm pretty happy with this apartment i would also recommend this to you and to other friends share this with your friends share this with your family so the next one you travel in singapore you know where to stay so next one guys we are going to do the food review of jollibee in singapore Let's go. Alright guys, we are actually here already. So the Jollibee is located at Lucky Plaza level 6. Guys, it's about lunch time. Let's order some meals inside.
Uh, one spaghetti mm -hmm. pie, okay. one pizza mango pie, okay. and, and then, then uh, one chicken sandwich as well. Like no meals, just a chicken sandwich. Okay, how about the drinks? Uh, no drinks. No yeah, drinks. that's all. Yeah. Okay, the chicken one piece spicy or regular? Uh, spicy, please. The one piece chicken spicy with spaghetti. Yep. And then you want one mango pie. Yep. And then the chicken burger, you want uh, spicy or regular? Uh, spicy as well. Yeah, uh, for takeaway please. Say okay, bye card. ta -da! We got our Jollibee takeaway. So first we try the spicy chicken and also the spaghetti. Which like they got carrot, cheese and like uh, spaghetti uh, bolognese here. Well, the color doesn't look like really red like in Philippines as uh, I see some from other youtubers I think the color looks alright looks quite um, like red orange which is like a normal spaghetti color so we're going to try now Never is not too sweet. It's like almost similar to a bolognese from the like Italian restaurants. It's just that slightly uh, not too acidic. Also, you can taste the cheese over there, the carrot, and also like uh, some minced beef, I believe. So I'm really happy with this. Um, I think I will give like. Uh, 8 out of 10 so yeah guys that's the spicy crispy chicken from Jollibee uh, looks alright it looks like um, the spicy chicken from McDonald in Indonesia I believe in Sydney there is no spicy chicken like this it's like in Sydney McDonald it's only like burgers and stuff but in here yeah, I think even like a uh, Singaporean McDonald's, uh, they have spicy chicken as well. Okay, let's try this. So juicy guys mm. Mm. Oh wow mm. Yeah I think they cook it really well this time The skin it's so crunchy and then the inside as you can see here guys it's like a uh, super juicy you know but um, I think flavor of the meat KFC is slightly better this is like a slightly bland but I think overall it's alright so I'll give like 8 out of 10 as well I'm quite happy with this uh, maybe I will eat like I can buy the second uh, piece of chicken that's the Jollibee chips or fries with salt without the gravy first if you want to have a better flavor I think you can dip uh, the chips uh, with the gravy yeah the gravy is quite salty and it also have really strong gravy flavor I'll give this uh, 7 out of 10 mm. I like the bread, it's, it's quite soft 
and also buttery and then the chicken um, it's quite big as well see it's like even hanging uh, outside of the bread oh yeah the chicken is actually chicken thigh guys because it's really juicy when you bite into it it's not dry like chicken breast it's pretty good but maybe less spicy is better I will give this like um, 7 out of 10 mm, yeah. so you can see here guys the outside it's crunchy pastry and then the inside is really good it's like runny mango and pits sauce or like a chunky small chunky mango in the inside it's sweet it has strong mango and pits flavor i will give this like 9 out of 10 and maybe if we can eat with uh, vanilla ice cream uh, that will be really good as well hey guys that's all the review like subscribe thank you again for your support thank you again for watching until the end of this video i hope you are entertained i hope you are blessed and i will see you in the next video thank you bye bye